so I am moving out of home so excited um, I think this is gonna be a great chance for me to grow and learn to be quite independent right so I'm excited for that I am Kinsani Mnisi on YouTube, Instagram and TikTok. I'd like to give you a very warm welcome to my YouTube channel. Remember to be subscribed and hit that notification bell. This is actually the only time I got to sit down and talk you guys through what's happening. So I realized I actually don't have anything, like to be quite frank, I have nothing. I don't have a bed, I don't have a micro, I basically have my place and myself like <laughs> that's all i have right so i'm taking you guys through this journey of me starting from scratch basically there's basically nothing i'm taking away like taking from home it's basically like my clothes my shoes and stuff um but yeah i'm also moving out of my office um i got a new space or another different location for deluxe academy classes and stuff which is also exciting but it, it has nothing to do with this vlog so today i'm moving out of the office space i am gonna get my stuff and i might as well also give you guys like a mini office tour so you can see what my office looked like it was my very first office i enjoyed my time there and my stay there um it was very nice but it's time for change time for new things i think there's so much change that took place in my life i mean i cut off my locks i moved out of my office place i'm moving out of home got in, like got my own place like a new place for deluxe academy and there's some exciting news something i'm working on which is quite exciting as well so yeah i'm excited and a bit nervous at the same time i don't know if i'm nervous about it or whatever but i think at this point i'm quite excited so let me not to talk too much before my battery dies and i'll take you guys with me on this amazing journey this was my very first office space i remember moving in here as if it was yesterday i thank god for really trusting me with this blessing and this is basically a reflection of how good god is and how far he has brought me in my life but letting go is never easy at this point in time i was feeling very sad and a bit emotional so many cre memories created in the space and i enjoyed being here and all of a sudden now i have to let go but i thank god because i'm not just letting go i'm letting go because he has bigger and better things in store for me it's a whole different chapter of my life that i'm supposed to step into which I'm grateful for. I have, haven't fully really moved, but I moved like a few, a few stuff in and I'm gonna leave it here. Um, I still have to get like, a cleaning company is coming through to like deep clean the whole place, the carpets and stuff. So I'm gonna wait for that to get done and then we're going to get like a few stuff. I need a bed, I need a micro oven, I need a fridge, I need a washing machine. I need everything I can think of, okay? So we're gonna do that and yeah, I love the fact that I can see my car here. I have such a nice view, oh my word. What do you think? Then what do you think? I'm such a fan of this. <laughs> What's the minute plate? Um, so I got some cloths as well. Good morning, guys. It is day two, right? Um, is it day two? I don't know, but it's another, it's another day. Um, my place is relatively still empty, you can probably hear. I hope there's no echo. I don't think there is because I have carpets in already. Right, but headed out to the mall right now and we are going to get a few stuff. I'm so excited to do this kind of shopping. <laughs> I want to scream. It's the fact that every single time I went into the stores, I always say I can't wait to actually shop in this segment. And now I'm shopping in that segment. Ah! That's how excited I am. I'm excited. We headed out to the mall. I'm hoping to get some curtains, bedding items. So let us go. Okay, but anyway, let us go. My what? What am I saying? But anyway, let us head out to the mall. Let's go. Very nice. But for what? 
Putana Pengale. I think I love that. I actually do. I actually do. I actually love that. Okay, so so far the, this is how it's looking. I have bedding stuff there and curtains. Bedding stuff there and curtains as well. I decided to go for blinds. So I got these blinds for kitchen and the toilet. Yeah, which I love. I went through might obviously. Let's see what else I need. This type of shopping is definitely not pop and place, hey? I'm taking this. Yeah. Two more pillowcases. I also got this cute bathroom set. I'm quickly going to unbox this, not unbox it, but like get it into the bathroom. So tomorrow when I come back, I am packing in or I'm packing my closet or whatever. Like we're focusing on the closet. Okay. That's what we're doing tomorrow. Relatively quite excited. Um, I'm also going to ensure that what else are we doing tomorrow? What is tomorrow? Even tomorrow is Friday. Um, I have Deluxe Academy classes, um, which is exciting. What else am I doing tomorrow? I'm trying to think. Well, we're probably going to go shop for a few more stuff again tomorrow. And yeah, yeah, that's that. So I'll see you guys on day three, which is tomorrow. Good morning guys, it is day three. I almost said, is it day three? Is it day? I think it's day three. I think it's day three. But it's whatever day. I'm in the process of moving. It's a daunting process, to be quite honest. I am actually, yeah, no. I am, yeah, no, I think you can see. My car is actually loaded at this point because I actually got all my shoes i was so shocked to realize that i actually have so many shoes i was shocked but i got all my shoes at home and today the plan is to pack all those shoes into my closet and stuff like that i don't know how this is going to work because my shoes are actually quite a lot um I was supposed to do the shoes and clothes, but I realized my shoes are a lot. So I said, let me first start with the shoes and then we'll move over to the clothes. Because at the area that I'm currently in, they told me that they have uh, a fridge and like, I can't even talk. At the area that I'm currently at, they told me that pick and pay is the nearest place that has like a uh, fridge, TV and all those stuff. I can't even talk at this point, but let's go shopping for those because i need a fridge so i'm gonna check at various stores to see if i can't get a fridge and i think i do need a tv i don't watch tv but it's gonna be quite weird to have like a place that does not have a tv you get what i'm saying so i think let me just get it even if i don't watch tv i'll connect it to youtube and stuff something like that but let us get started with this day i've basically arrived at the first location let me just grab my keys and what else will i need um of course my phone i've arrived at the first location where we're going to check for a few 
appliances. Do they call these things appliances? Yeah, home appliances. And then, yeah, I'm quite excited. Let's go. This is mine, ne? Yeah, this is yours. I really love this. Mm. Oh, and the quality chair. Yeah. And Mangtoli Bays is so I don't and I mean warranty ten years, that's that's good. Yeah, good Hi guys, it is a new day. It's a new day in the moving process. I can finally talk to you guys quick quickly before I move on with the day. So I got I went out to go get a bed, which is they're gonna pick up and then I'm headed out to game now to get a few more appliances so that we can pick up the bed and the, all the other appliances and I think everything is coming together. Um, I'm not a TV person so I did not think a TV was important. <laughs> Have a fridge! Okay, where do we start? Start here. The lighting is extremely bad, but I'm so excited. Um, this is my bed. My bed has arrived. I'm so happy with the quality of bed I want or I chose. This is okay. My camera cut me, but as I was saying, this is the base, and this is my actual bed, which I'm also gonna unbox shortly. Ah, so excited! It feels so good to be wearing my paper. You get what I'm saying? Like, my <laughs> another day in the vlog I just came back sorry I'm trying to pull this box I came back from doing some shopping grocery shopping and a few stuff I went to Woolies for groceries um, I went to Woolies for groceries and then I went to Pep Home for like a few stuff I needed I'll actually show you guys what I got I actually show you guys what I got in fact let me do that right let's start with pep home because woolies is like I got basic grocery stuff so my camera just decided to die on me but anyway as I was saying I got a cutlery tray because I already got cutlery but I needed like a tray to put it in I'm actually gonna charge my camera let me charge my camera okay so as I already showed you guys I got a cutlery tray how cute is this I absolutely love it please don't mind my nails at this point it's the last thing i'm focusing on and then i also got some of these because i still need to put up kit, um, curtains in the last room i'm actually done with all my curtains just curtains in the last room and i was actually short these things what do you call this what do they call this gliders oh interesting and i actually got this for my bathroom because it's literally the only thing that i needed and I already showed you guys this, but I got a thingamablob. I have no idea what it's called. And how cute are these, you guys? 
all from Pep Home. And how much was this? This was 55 Rand and this was 60 Rand. And the big one was how much? 65. So how cute is this? I like how it matches with the colors of my kitchen and I absolutely loved every bit of it. And yeah, so these are stuff I got at Pep Home. And in there, in here, I basically just have some groceries. Let me see. Yeah, so I just have a few groceries. I actually got myself some hot cross buns. I got a few, um, I got some juice and stuff just so I can put in my fridge. And yeah, and so I can actually have something to eat. So I'm quickly gonna pack this while I charge the battery of my camera. I think I'm gonna end this vlog here just so it's not like too lengthy and stuff, but I am pretty much still in shock, to be quite honest. Um, when I went out for grocery shopping today and running like a few errands, I realized how I've actually dreamt of this life so much. And the fact that God did that, and did all this is like my heart is filled with so much gratitude i'm so i'm in shock i'm in disbelief and yeah there's a lot of emotions but being in shock being in disbelief like it still hasn't sunk in it's like every single time i get here and i park my car outside i'm just like wow god did that it's like God did that for me and it's a big thing for me because this has always just been a dream it has always just been a prayer and the fact that I'm living in an answered prayer and the fact that God did this for me but God has been so good and I've seen God so much in my life and um, I hope through my whole entire journey you see that age is just a number honestly you're not defined by your age you're not defined by your family backgrounds you're not defined by where you come from if you come from a place where things are not good at home that does not have to be your whole entire life you have the power to change that within you the power lies within you and trusting god trust god and god will do it for you and do not just rely on your own strength and your own understanding whether you're 45 and you feel like you still want to change your life it's still the perfect age to do so if you're 65 and you still want to go after your dreams it is still the perfect age to do so if you're 14 you still want to go for your dreams that is the perfect age to do so age is just a number don't let it define you don't let it define any of your accomplishments don't even let it define anything in your life um but i'm just here to say i'm grateful and once again this is a god move but there's absolutely no way this could have been possible and could have been done by my own strength or by just my hard work absolutely not um this is favor this is grace that god has placed upon my life it's a blessing and as i said in my pre previous video i always pray that god helps me sustain blessings because i always say god for instance now god if you've trusted me with this blessing i ask that you help me sustain it i ask that you help me use this blessing in a way that will glorify you in a way that will give all the praises and all the honors back to you because it has nothing to do with me and i know god that every single thing you do in my life is according to purpose and even this space and even where you've placed me at now it's all according to your purpose but yeah i'm very grateful and I'm thankful, I'm happy, I'm excited and I don't even want to get emotional in this vlog because in the car vlog I got emotional and I'm trying to not get emotional. Thank you so much for going on this journey with me and yeah I can't wait to watch this back when I'm probably like a few years from now or yeah this is one thing I love so much about YouTube is because can always refer back to those memories and i always say it's my memory book and that is why it's so important for me to vlog certain moments like these in my life um and i'm so happy to be able to take you along with this or you along with me in this you know so yeah i'll see you guys on a, on my next video and until next time i'm out